Hi everybody, today is June 23rd, 2016. It's 2.44 p.m. my local time. And uh, this morning, I just knew uh, cutting up uh, and re-editing the Alex Jones show for June 22nd, 2016 went way too easy and also uh, InfoWars Nightly News for June 22nd, 2016. And my suspicions were correct. Uh, the scumbags at Google controlled YouTube uh, flagged the videos. And they didn't do it instantly. It was about an hour later. So my videos were late going up. Other people uh, had it up. I had it up for an hour, hour and a half as I let people finish watching the shows before I cut the offending material out and um, actually made a video with this phone that I'm doing now and editing in um, within one second. So it's identical to what I have. And you could see here, it's the same shows. But these are the ones that were flagged and I deleted them from my channels. Because the, the scumbags aren't going to get any free money, free publicity from my channel. So, uh, in question is Oprah Winfrey. This rich bitch, this racist black woman, billionaire from Chicago. And go figure, right? Chicago, the unarmed city that you never hear about her doing anything for black people other than getting money. And if you look at the audience, it's really very few black people in the audience. It's maybe about 10%. And then the other, other part was Junkin Media, Junkin Media, Parasite, another Parasite organization. And um, it was about 35 seconds worth of video. And, and again, if they were smart, they would want exposure. But they're fucking greedy. These are greedy scumbags that want to make money off of other people's videos. And I want you to understand, I have a Alex Jones production uh, release form giving me permission for use. Nonprofit use. And if I let these assholes advertise on my channel, then I'm in violation. Alex Jones Productions could sue me, but I know they won't do it. But in the future, what can happen? So let's take a look at this. Uh, look at this. Fall on your face. Junkin Media will pay you for money, right? Inside the company that made viral videos, big business. Are they making the videos? No, but they're parasites. They make money on other people's videos. Let's take another look here. Junkin Media gives Ryan Seacrest, another asshole, guy that rode the, 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 to fame on uh, America's uh, favorite videos, whatever the hell it is, uh, scummy thing, people with some talent and they put such contracts on them that they're underneath them virtually forever. So this asshole, who gives a shit about this asshole? So more and more parasites are claiming to own or represent people for their video and I actually looked for the video in this, and I couldn't find it in their list on uh, Junkin uh, Video. What the hell is it? Went looking through their, their videos, and I couldn't find the video in question. So each one of these, you see this? This is it. This is it. And the, the video is not on the list but they claim ownerships or the rights to it or represent the person, yet it's not here. It's a bogus claim, so I do it my way. I take it out, and as I said, use the trick, switch the format, switch the size, 
then use uh, Windows Movie Maker, put the pieces back together. Um, I'd suggest that you change the format again. So it's got your your ID on there, your um, sort of digital fingerprint on there, and they can't claim ownership of it. So have a great day, and don't let these scumbags push you around and claim that they own the video when they actually don't. If push comes to shove, you could actually press this and win. But I have my different way of doing it. You have to choose yours. Have a great day. And again, thanks for watching my video. And if you like Alex Jones videos, you better go and buy yourself a Prison Planet TV membership as I do. Don't be a parasite like these people. Have a great day.